Hello my French traders, Caroline Lizan here, a graduate student of the Grog Trade Mentoring Program. It is Thursday, June 30th of 2011 and we're looking at the Q's Daily Chart. Wow! What a beautiful breakout to the upside through that upper area of uh, resistance that I mentioned to you yesterday. Actually a crossover of two major areas of resistance on our way up. The first one was at the 50-day moving average, which is here in red, which we talked about yesterday. And the second one is where this purple trend line is coming down. So that is a pretty significant area of resistance that we are breaking through today to the upside, closing above both of them. But what you can see here, we are approaching another area of resistance right here at the 57.20. So pay really close attention to that one tomorrow. And then once we break through the 5720 mark and then close above it, we could head all the way up to that next area of resistance and way up here, the 5790 mark. And then the next major one would be here at about the 5830 mark. And then the next one at 5865. And then we could push it all the way back to the high of May 2nd, which was at the 59.34. So pay really close attention to all of them here. And as you can see, we are still in a pretty nice uptrend, making higher highs and higher lows, which is a good sign with this very nice MACD confirmation. As you can see, the MACD is still rising, is still pointing higher above the zero line. So this is a pretty nice and significant confirmation of that up run and volume is not bad is slightly below the average but it's still rising it's still kind of high so that is another nice confirmation so these are the areas of resistance that you really need to pay close attention to tomorrow but if we instead get a little bit of a pullback we could pull back down to that lower area support right here, the 55.85 mark. And then we could stop at this lower area support right here, where you see the eight moving average rising, which is a good sign. And it's here in green. So the green line here is just the eight moving average, which we been talking about for quite a while and this is my favorite one so pay close attention to that one as we get closer to it if we ever get closer to it because it's a significant area of support and then the next one would be right below it at the 55 30 mark and then the next major one would be right here where you see this blue line which is the 200 day moving average and it's another area of support that we really need to pay close attention to so that's what we have here happening for now. So tomorrow again, pay really close attention to all areas of resistance that I showed you, as well as the areas of support that could be, that could be really significant um, areas uh, for a little bit of a pullback if we ever get one. So yeah, so that's, uh, that's all I have for today. Hope you enjoyed it and thanks for staying with Rock Trade. Have a great day and I'll talk to you again tomorrow.